Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and this video is going to be about the envelope tool. I've made a couple of videos on the envelope tool, or maybe more than a couple, but a, a subscriber was having trouble with it, and I, I figured out while I was doing the video what, what his trouble was. First of all, you can't envelope that word going this way on this horse, even if you angle the text at that angle. So double click on your unicorn and move him kind of you know, flatter. Get your freehand tool. Let's zoom in here a little bit. Get your freehand tool and just freehand a, a line around here. Now it's real important that this meets. And one way you can check it is get your smart fill tool and fill in that little area. And so we're, we've, we've done a good job. Take your pick tool and encompass or lasso both of them go up to intersect so you made an intersect of that shape go up to effects envelope tool grab your horse get your eyedropper and put the arrow inside your shape and then put apply and now you're we can actually get rid of this red circle and now your horse will be in the shape of that body you can move it around a little bit and uh, put your nudge factor on real low and just kind of cursor up and over and until you get it in there and you would possibly want to make depending on what you're going to do if you were going to cut this out but that's how you do it but I did figure out where he was going wrong Let's move this out of the way and let's move this because he kept talking about he had broken lines and and he even sent me pictures and I couldn't figure out what he was doing. Well, my box isn't connected. So let's do this. Let's lasso it all, intersect. Then let's move our intersect away. Well, it didn't even do it, but we move our box away. And that's what he was getting. He wasn't getting the complete deal because his lines weren't connected. So before you do that, make sure your lines are connected. Anyway, it's a pretty cool effect. You can almost use it on any shape. And uh, hope that helped him and hope that you learned a little bit. And thank you for watching.